Okay, so now we will be looking at pleural effusion. Pleural effusion is a condition in which accumulation of fluid in the pleural cavity occurs. There are two types of pleural effusion. One is exudative and another is transudative pleural effusion. Exudative pleural effusion in which there is greater than 3 gram per liter protein and in this water moves out of the cells and example of uh, exudative pleural effusion is lung cancer. While transudative pleural effusion is when there is less than 3 gram per liter proteins and fluid moves across the lungs and other causes of transudative pleural effusion are hypoalbuminemia, Meeks syndrome which includes cancer ascites. So these are two types of pleural effusion, exudative and transudative pleural effusion. Clinical features of pleural effusion are shortness of breath will be there, patient will complain of difficulty of the breathing, dullness and percussion, trachea will be deviated to the opposite side in pleural effusion. Lips will be x-ray, chest x-ray which shows fluid in the fissures, large effusion, if there is large effusion then there, there will be trachea and mediastinum will be deviated. Now let's suppose looking at this, uh, we can conclude that let's suppose this is x-ray, this is right side and this is left side and from here is the massive effusion then the trachea will be deviated opposite side to the left means it will be deviated to the right side. Another lab article investigation will be aspiration, chest drainage will be performed and aspiration uh, from that aspiration we can look at the protein count and cell count, we can look at the pH of the fluid and glucose of the fluid. So in this way we can perform lab article investigations. So how will we manage the pleural effusion for management? There is conservative treatment in initial phase, then pleural aspiration is performed, repeated aspiration and chest drain is performed in, in uh, large pleural effusion. Now let's suppose this is chest cavity and lungs are present in it. Chest drain is applied in order to remove the effusion fluid and uh, treat the patient. So in this way we can treat the patient of pleural effusion.